I guess the question I get asked most is, why? Why do you travel 1400 miles away from your home to visit the same park year after year? This fall marked my sixth straight year making the Western pilgrimage to Zion, and despite the frequency, I can honestly say that the park has never lost any of its appeal for me. The first landmark you see on the drive-in is the towering West Temple. Seeing this massive pillar of sandstone still fills me with the same sense of excitement today as it did five years ago. Of course, that's not to say that Zion itself is the same. On the contrary, the park is always changing. One advantage of visiting year after year is that you gain a sense of appreciation for the park's nuance. A new bend in the Virgin River, or an especially good year for fall color, cannot truly be appreciated if you have never experienced anything different in the past. This newness is part of what excites me about visiting the same place year after year. But you can never really recapture those lost moments of seeing the park for the first time. Or can you? It turns out all that's needed is a slightly new perspective on some very familiar ground. The first sight of the white cliffs from above immediately transported me back to that very first magical day in the Narrows. I was a kid seeing the park all over again for the very first time. Being able to share this with friends was the fulfillment of a lifelong goal and something I'll never forget. And speaking of friends, they're as integral to the park now as burning through sheets of Velvia. Every year I look forward to seeing familiar faces and being introduced to new ones. Hearing everyone's daily reports is almost as fun to me as exposing my own film. And this year came with an added bonus in that I was able to introduce my wife to the park that means so much to me. Seeing the park through her eyes was yet another way for me to experience Zion for the first time. So after all this time, why Zion? I guess the short answer simply is, it's Zion. It's my home away from home, and there's nowhere else I'd rather be. I don't know what next year has in store, but I can't wait to see everything all over again for the very first time.